Hello, Mina. My name is Chris Wilson. In this video, we will go over how to stake Mina using Hubble, your Web3 Explorer by Figment. A few prerequisites you will need in order to follow this guide are one, a Ledger device. I'm using the Ledger Nano S, and you can pick one up at shop.ledger.com if you do not have one. Number two, you'll need to add the Mina app to your Ledger device if you haven't done so already. You can find a guide in the Mina docs linked below, and that's at docs.minaprotocol.com slash en slash advanced slash ledger dash app dap dash Mina. Again, that'll be linked down below for ease and convenience. And finally, you will need to sign up for a free account at hubble.figment.io. Now that we have that out of the way, let's jump into it by navigating to hubble.figment.io, signing in and scrolling down to Mina, and we can click on the protocol. And now we have the Hubble Explorer for Mina, and we can see all the actions going on. Very neat. Now when we come down to the validators, we can click on Figment. And under here, we will see all of the action for the Figment validator. And up here, where it says stake now, we can go ahead and click that. Now this is gonna ask us to connect our ledger device. So we can go ahead and do that now. Enter your pin, and then go over to the Mina app and double click on it. It's gonna say this app is not genuine, but you're gonna wanna go right click, right click until you get to the open app and then double click the buttons. And now it will say Mina is ready. Now we have here, this is uh, your default. It's normally zero, which is okay. We'll hit continue. Now on the ledger device, it will say get address. So you will click right. And then it will show you the path. You will click right again until you see the check mark generate and then double click. Now it says processing on the ledger and it is generating and confirming the public address on the ledger. All right, and then on the ledger, you will see your new address pop up and you're gonna wanna click right five times and then it will say approve and you can double click. Now here we can see our account address and we can see the balance of Mina. I don't have any Mina, so this is going to fail when I do it. And then you'll see the transaction fee associated with the delegation. We can sign with our ledger. And on the ledger, it says sign transaction. So we will right click. And it says the type is a delegation. We will right click again. And then it will show our delegator's address. And then it will say the delegate address. And it will show the fee, the nonce, the memo. And then finally approve. And we can double click approve and it will sign the transaction. And there we go. There is our error because I don't have any Mina, but if you did have Mina like this, success, after the confirmed transaction, so you'd have the success, and then after a few minutes, it would show up on Hubble right here, and you'd be able to click on details and see your delegation right there. And that's how easy it is to stake Mina with Figment using Hubble. How awesome is that? As always, if you had any trouble following this tutorial or simply want to discuss Mina or Hubble tech, you can join our Discord in the link down below. I look forward to seeing you there. And until next time, happy staking.